road, but nope, it's not that easy. It's never that easy. The game likes to be difficult. Are you freaking kidding me? Montreal scored on Toronto down a five on three power play. Wow, I'm actually kind of curious as to how long it's been since that's happened. That's just bad. You you know you're a terrible team when you give up a goal when you're up five on three. Oh man, only Toronto would ever be able to do that. I don't think that team can get any more embarrassing. I'm, I'm sorry, fail face, if you're watching these videos, but... Unless I was looking at the screen wrong, it looks like Toronto gave up a goal shorthanded five on three, so... I know Failface says he's a Toronto fan, so it's just... I just cannot help but make fun of the Maple Leafs. It's just... Honestly, they, they make it so easy. Like, I know Vancouver has their things they've done that make it easy to mock them. Like, obviously, blowing the cup finals. But still, Toronto always just makes it, like, super easy. <laughs> I, just can't, can't, I just can't help but laugh. Uh, whatever. A draft lottery of Blue Jackets over his Canadians on his Maple Leafs. I don't know if it's a f good thing or a bad thing. There's three Canadian teams in the bottom five of the league. That almost makes it a little saddening. Only two Canadian teams made it to the playoffs this year. I think there was... Actually, I think there's only there's only two last year, too. But still, it's kind of a little disappointing. Yeah, fuck. I don't know if I finished what I was talking about earlier with... Uh, with the Blue Jays, just saying last year, how many times, how many blown saves they had. They had like 25, 30 blown saves. And it's just like, oh, we got this new closer and everything. And we're all thinking, oh, man, this is going to be great. We got a closer now. This team's going to be so much better. Game two of the season, and he already has a blown save. They managed to win in extras, but it's just like, really, dude, you're running here to be our fucking savior, and you're blowing saves in game two of the season. It's like, can we not do that? That would be fantastic, man. Ugh. Um. Burning rush. Burning rush. <sighs> Damn it. Is that chainmail is helping with the the damage of my station? At least on Albert. I wish I could find a second one though. It'd be nice to give one to Dart too, but. Oh well. I think the magic defense is going to help Albert out a lot more and it's going to help Dart, so. It's not such a bad idea to have it right now. I don't remember if Burning Rush's damage ever does go up or not. Whatever, the stupid thing should be dead. Go away, little duck man. I think uh, Volcano's damage is going to be higher than Burning. The thing with Dart is, is he has, I think, two of his additions are extremely weak damage-wise, but they give a shitload of, like, uh, spirit points, so it's it's kind of debatable. And, uh, you kind of have to pick and choose a little bit. Obviously, damage is nice. Yeah, it's still only 150. I think I'm going to change back to Volcano, because I think the boss is in this next room. Okay, can we get up on the path? Jesus. What's the hell problem that's happening there? Ah, yes. That was a good idea that I switched. Who is this? Is that you, Lavitz? It's so ironic to find you venturing here. You are Graham. Do you know him? I will never forget him. He used to be the head of the second knighthood of Basil Graham. The man who used to be my father's best man. For some reason, the game has a big pan out and he's like really far in the background. <gasps> Creepy music. Welcome, Lavitz. You have become a knight fulfilling the wishes of your late father, Servi. Don't you ever mention my father's name. Are you still carrying that grudge after more than a dozen years from my betrayal of your father? That's not all. You betrayed King Albert. You betrayed every single person I know. My throat's like starting to hurt. Is that the wrath of a patriotic knight or a man full of vengeance? Both! Graham, I now get to avenge my father who trusted you and died in vain. Get revenge, huh? Try. See if you can truly best me in my newly obtained power. Oh, should I need to cough? <coughs> <coughs> Emerge the power of the dragon! Oh, shit. You... You are a dragoon? 
It shouldn't be a surprise. Only the Dragoons can manipulate dragons. Behind the dragon, there should be. Or behind the Dragoon, there should be a dragon. I like to know how this thing's even fitting in here. Or where the hell that thing even came from. This is the power I obtained. Obtaining that power is not an easy matter. You, where did you get that Dragoon spirit? I'm amazed there is someone in Basil who knows about this. Fine, you too will know before you die. His Majesty Dull got all his power and intelligence from Emperor Diaz. Is this some kind of dream? Emperor Diaz died 11,000 years ago with the name of the Holy Imperial Gloriano. If this is a dream, how can you explain what you are about to see? Come, I give you a chance to avenge your father if you have the courage to fight against the legendary Dragoon! <laughs> yeah, guitar one. That dragon looks way smaller in battle than it does outside of the battle. <laughs> so, whatever. Uh, honestly, I don't even know which one's better to attack. I think I'll just attack Graham. Yes. How much damage is this shoot gonna do? 54 is not bad. This is probably the hardest fight we're gonna face right now. Yeah, he uses just a bit of a jerk. Actually, that didn't do that much damage at all. Just keep using that attack, that'll be great. Whip smack. 37, man. Never. I find it funny how early in. Yeah, he uses a lot of poison attacks. I found it. Great, needs poison now. Anyway, like I was saying, I find it funny that uh, earlier in the game when we were fighting that stupid snake thing in the cave, we couldn't attack it when he was up in that cave rocks, and yet we can attack the Greyhound who's flying <laughs> from the ground. Figure that one out. That's about 50 each. Rose does about 40, so it's not quite, but... Definitely a good idea to switch to... Back to this edition. I know it sucks because I don't level up uh, the other edition, but you know what? You level up the editions out of at random battles, not not these fights. I don't even know if I'm gonna bother using the dra dragoon power or not. I might. See, he's already yellow. I might use uh, her one dragoon spell to heal everybody. It's not a bad idea. Damn it! Quit doing that. I'm pretty sure when you turn into a Dragoon, too, it actually gets rid of the status effects, so it's not such a bad idea. I'm actually surprised he's not countering. You'd think if, if all people a Dragoon would be countering. But hey, what? Oh, shit. This is where he starts becoming really nasty. Yeah, this is gonna fucking hurt. I better turn into a Dragoon and heal. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Look how much damage my agitation that chainmail does. Oh shit, Dart's really taking a beating here. Yes. I better have him attack and hope that Rose gets the next attack. Volcano! Volcano! Oh shit, well, I think I even attack Dart. Can you quit doing that now? If the dragon attacks Dart, that's probably it. Uh, yeah, let's just turn into a Dragoon. Use your healing magic. Looks like she's just being like molested when she turns into a dragoon. Some of her dra her dragoon transformation and one of her spells, and some of her spells are really just like, what the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> it's just like, ah, it's creepy. Death dimension. No, oh, it's just. Maybe get lucky and might even actually finish him off. Maybe. Of course, it won't. It won't do anywhere near as much damage healing wise because he should have pretty good magic defense. Kinda. I think. Actually, I'm not sure if this one does. I'll have to find out. Yes. Poop out your healing beam. Yeah, I went there. It's just, it's just funny. It just makes you wonder what the hell the designers were thinking. Eh, 31, 31, 31. Not bad. Ugh, I got a deep gash. <laughs> he just disappears, leaves the dragon here. Yeah, attack her. She's the one in Dragoon form. She's like all the special armor, extra armor and shit. Anyway, so Greyhound's out of the picture, so that's uh, that's a good start. Yeah, yeah, you're still poisoned. So I'll turn into a Dragoon with him too. Yes. Sixty-four. Not bad. Yeah, might as well just use Astro Drain one more time. 
It's just good for the healing, really. I mean, I could probably do a lot more damage with with uh, her just her rune attack, but the health is the health is helpful. See, this one makes a little more sense. The sword's actually stabbed into the enemy there. <laughs> It's actually really loud. I'm trying to figure out why the hell the spells are so loud. Probably it's probably louder than me, which is a little annoying, but at least it's not static like it was when I first used Dart's fireball attack. Actually that did pretty good damage anyway, so never mind. And there goes to ruin form. Well at least I got some healing out of it. That's good. Attacking power. Oh shit. Yeah, that's right. He does this. I don't think the magic signal signal stone works. 60. Oh, bitch. Uh, um, I don't think the signet stone works on this thing. I kind of, I kind of don't want to waste a turn trying either. So, oh, son of a bitch. I need a fucking heal. One more poison thing, and that'll be the end of them. 35. Yeah, the dragon's already in yellow. Probably just because I got a good amount of damage going off. Yeah, 60, 55, 60, 100, and whatnot. And I went to Dragon Spell, so that's not bad. I didn't realize how low of health she was either. Oh, shit. What if I just turn it into Dragoon with Dart? Hey, why not? I got him, right? Let's use the friggin' spells. I don't remember if, uh, if Wind is weak. No, we Wind wouldn't be weak to fire, I don't think. Maybe. I don't remember how the, how the elements work. I think darts is a little cooler than roses. It makes a little more sense. She just goes into like a ball of darkness, and it's just like, what the fuck are you doing? Fire strength 25 for all. Fire strength 50% single. Should just attack. He's almost dead anyway. See if I can fuck this up or not. Oh, perfect! Fuck yeah! I remember being really bad at these, and I just kind of stopped ever bothering to even turn to Blue Drifter unless it was using magic. Done all right. 80 off. 80 is not that strong at all. What the hell? Let's see. He might be dead here, actually. He's pretty close. Yep, sweet. Victory is mine. Somebody go eat a dragon or a lizard. Go eat a green lizard. Go eat. In, go. Someone go bite the tail off an iguana. Downburst. 1,200 experience. Nice. Any more addition. Well, Shannon in the background. What? No additions? Jeez. Come on. Give me something. You have survey strength. My efforts were to no avail. I even used betrayal to obtain this power. I still don't understand. Why did you betray my father? You were not like this. Nobody could be stronger than your father. That was the only thing I could do. I could never conquer. I had admiration for him as a mate and as a friend. But time goes by and it turned into this feeling. This fear from realizing the limits of your ability. This fear that goes nowhere. The only thing you can do is curse yourself for weakness. But you couldn't overcome your fear by defecting to Dole. You needed to overcome my father. There was an alternative. If only I could obtain a new power, I could be equal or surpass him. <clears throat> that was the Dragoon spirit I got from His Majesty Dole. Lavitz, live strong. Now I can go to be with Servi. Blah. Blah. Oh, he dead. Oh, that's convenient. We don't have to carry his body around or anything. He is lucky to be dead now. Greed for power eventually conquers you, and unleashed power generates only sorrow. He should have known that. He was lucky to die now and avoid even more sorrow. Oh, what does this mean? Oh, oh, look at this. Huh? What is this? Holy shit! It's a green ball. Such a coincidence. It can't be. Or is this fate? Yeah, in case you weren't telling you, talking to herself. Lavitz, maybe you are too. Maybe you too are. Dart is right. The Dragoon spirit of the Jade Dragoon recognized you as the next master. But the dragon's dead. I am a Dragoon? I deserve to rule dragons? Not only do you deserve, but you have an obligation to accept your fate as a Dragoon, don't you? We just killed his dragon, though. Like, that seems kind of silly. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> it 
is what Graham left for me, I understand. I